In the past 20 years, no invention has shaped our lives more than the World Wide Web. Everybody goes online to find education, business, entertainment, and to connect with other people. But in the future, the web will change the lives of every single one of us in a much, much bigger way. Let me show you how. Today's web is divided in two sides. There's a people side, where you and your friends are, and there's a machine side, where your laptop and mobile phone are. More and more things are joining the web. Your television, your local supermarkets, in a few years, your refrigerator will join the web, and yes, even your cocktail machine. The problem is, there's a line in between the two sides. Now, what separates people from machines? It's a language thing. We speak human languages, but they are speaking machine languages. They have trouble understanding us, and we have trouble understanding them, and they have trouble understanding each other. Now, my research is part of a plan that aims to solve this problem, and this plan is called the semantic web. The semantic web is a layer on top of the existing web that makes machines understand the information on there. Nowadays, we people are surfing to websites, but thanks to the semantic web, your mobile phone becomes smart enough to surf the web by itself. For example, it can go to the homepage of your local supermarket, and it will understand it can buy stuff there. And it will be able to buy stuff there. This is exciting because those machines are joining the web that we use every day. It's a pretty big thing, but it's also confusing. Machines are going to use the web? What will they do on there? They will do things for you. Ladies and gentlemen, let's imagine the future web. Suppose you want to do something with your friends. Instead of organizing everything yourself, thanks to the semantic web, you can just say to your mobile, hey, I'm having a dinner party tonight with my best friends. And then it answers, well, you all like lasagna, but Julie's a vegetarian, so here's a good recipe. By the way, the refrigerator says you're out of tomatoes, so it ordered some in your local store. The oven will start heating while you go get the tomatoes and the cocktail machine will make you guys a drink. Did you see how I was able to talk to my devices and how they were able to talk to each other, and how they just organized a dinner party for us? Well, this, this is the future web, and it's the web I believe in. So if you thought that the web has already changed your life, think again, because the future web will change so much more. <laughs>